In a major development, NASA confirmed that astronauts Sunita Williams and Butch Wilmore, who have been stranded aboard the International Space Station for over nine months due to technical issues with their Starliner spacecraft, will return to Earth in the wee hours of Wednesday morning. The two astronauts originally on a 10-day mission found themselves unable to return after their Boeing Starliner capsule experienced propulsion malfunctions. Their return is now set to take place aboard the SpaceX Crew Dragon spacecraft, which successfully docked at the ISS on Sunday. They will be joined by NASA astronaut Nick Haig and Russian cosmonaut Alexander Golbunov. NASA stated that the ocean's splashdown is expected to occur near the Florida coast at approximately 5.57 p.m. ET on Tuesday on March 19th. The return was initially scheduled for Wednesday but was moved up to ensure better weather conditions for the landings. NASA said in a statement that the updated return target continues to allow the space station crew members time to complete handover duties while providing operational flexibility ahead of less favorable weather conditions expected for later in the week. The arrival of the SpaceX Crew Dragon capsule is part of NASA's routine crew rotation mission, but this flight took on added urgency as it became the long-awaited means of returning Williams and Wilmore to Earth. As anticipation for their return builds, Elon Musk on Monday shared a video of two astronauts expressing gratitude to him and US President Donald Trump for aiding their return. The 25-second clip posted on social media platform X features Williams, saying, We are coming back before long, so don't make those plans without me. We will be back before too long. Trump had previously commented on their prolonged stay in space, blaming the Biden administration for leaving them behind. He said in an address that we love you and we are coming up to get you. You shouldn't have been up there for so long. The most incompetent president in our history allowed this to happen to you. But this president won't let that happen. We are going to get you out. He also made specific remarks about Williams, referring to her hair in zero gravity. And I see the women with wild hair, a good, solid head of hair she's got. There's no kidding, no games with her hair. But you know, there is a danger up there too. They could face failures, which could be very bad. We have got to get them out. So I authorized Elon a week ago. As Williams and Wilmore prepare for their long-awaited return, NASA has finally confirmed that astronaut Sunita, Williams and Butch Wilmore stranded on the ISS for over nine months, will finally return to Earth on Tuesday.